Hey y'all, Martha here. I'm jumping in with part two of um, collaging in my um, glue book slash collage book. And I have been playing around with some items here. And I think I've kind of got it here. I don't know how much of my mess you can see, but excuse that. I got mess everywhere. So, um, <clears throat> I cut out some elements and, uh, well, there was some that was already cut out. But, um, I rounded the corners on most of them. And I kind of distressed the edges of them. Now this paper kind of blends in with this, but I'm going to try to rem rem excuse me while I try to talk. <laughs> I'm going to try to remedy that when I get them all glued down. And I think I want to start with this pretty postcard. And I'm just going to say, uh, back them all with pink paper to help them stand out a little bit. But I do think they need a little bit more. Uh, if I had had a darker piece of cardstock, I might have used that. I actually might have could have hunted down a piece of scrap paper, but I didn't think of it. So this is what I'm going with. So it's kind of a, a layout. And I guess the postcard and the little lady with the fruit on her head is the main focal point. But it really goes all the way across both pages. Okay. Uh, I did consider doing some painting on this one, but I just wanted to play with some paper today. That is really cute. I love this book that I got that from. So right now I'm just kind of gluing things down. I think I need a little bit more here. Okay, and I kind of wanted this little stamp up here. So, um, I guess I told you, but I will repeat it again in case I forgot. Back this on light, a light cardstock in pink, and I rounded the corners on a lot of them, not every one. And then I distressed the edges a little bit. And now I'm just trying, I was playing with the layout a little bit. Um, I have some things here that I may or may not add. Just when I get some things put down here, I will try it and see if I like it. So I've had this picture for a long time and I cut it out of a book and, um, since it's kind of a fruity theme, she's carrying fruit on her head, I just carried it a little further with the fruit. I had these little cards that um, 
Someone from an ATC swap sent me. I believe it was somebody from Australia, but uh, don't hold me to that because I'm not all positive. Okay, now got this little circle, but I think I might go ahead and put my quote on here. So I thought this was pretty appropriate and kind of appropriate for people who do YouTube channels like me and a lot of my subscribers. Why not go out on a limb? That's where the fruit is, Mark Twain. So I really kind of like that quote. And now I just printed this, um, wrote this out on my uh, iPad and then just printed it out and backed it also. I didn't round the corners on these. Now it's all looking like one um, value of color, like a medium value. I'm going to try to bring it out a little bit more. I guess that's not a good place for that circle there where it bends. So I'm just going to put it right here. I kind of wanted to use some washi tape that is if I did not um, I kind of want it like that I kind of I don't know. We shall see. I want to put some on here somewhere because it's a nice, pretty blue. And there is a, uh, quite a bit of blue in this collage. If I can get this peeled up without messing it up. Uh, it doesn't want to come up. I guess this is when it would pay to have a little bit of fingernails. Let me see if I can find some tweezers really quick to see if that will help me or mess it up worse. Got a little piece up. For some reason, I can't hold on to it. <laughs> there we go. I guess it did help a little. Now, let me see. Well, maybe I should have put this down. going to put it all the way across but I really didn't want to cover up my words so much. I think that looks kind of nice on there. Um, maybe I'll put 
piece down here. This is really busy, but if you've watched any of my videos, you know I really kind of like busy. No, I think I'm going to leave that for now. Okay. I have this little clear wax melt that was sent to me by Penny's Crafty Creations and some birthday mail. And I am going to put a flower in it from, um, this is Crafts and tea with Janet K sent me this in an embellishment box during a swap so I'm also going to use this to bring out some color I think that really is a nice bright color okay now I will, I'm going to go around this with Sharpie, um, just to kind of outline some of this pink paper and to make it stand out a little more. I was going to use Posca pen, but Let's use this Sharpie. It's a little bit quicker, I think, and save my paint pen for a bigger project. And as you see, my outline is not perfect. But that's okay. I, I'm okay with it. piece of washi tape is wanting to come up. I am going to put a dab of this Fabri-Tac down here. Okay. Well, I really got out of that one really badly. Okay, let me turn it around. Now those words look like they might have should have I should have went around them a little bit too. But to make them match that oxide, I think I will go around it with a stabilo all. Since it'll give me kind of the same result. Not quite, but similar. Now, if I really want it to stand out, I could wet it. But it's kind of bad to get um, 
too dark and messy if you're not careful. So I might not wet it today. There, I kind of like that. Wonder if I should outline this circle, this uh, wax melt. Okay, that stands out a little better. Now, let me see. Um, I had some buttons and butterfly. Let me see if I use some of those if it's overkill. Hmm. I think I am going to put this butterfly down here right in the middle. If I can get the sticker off. I always have a hard time. Have a hard time with stickers. So let me find my trusty tweezer here. See if that helps any at all. Hmm. Okay, there we go. No, I kind of like it like that. And I'm not going to outline it because everything doesn't need to be outlined. And I also have this one here. So should I put it somewhere? Let's go ahead and just stick it down here for the fun of it. And let me see. It's really looking busy. I love it. <laughs> okay, I have a gold pen here. And I do have a little gold here. I think I'm going to go around the edge of the pages with my gold pen. Because I'm in love with this gold pen. And I like to use it whenever I get the opportunity. with a little bit of black ink too um, just kind of unify all of this where I have everything outlined I think it might look nice This is a really nice pen. It's called uh, Deco Color Premium. And it is on Amazon is where I got it. It has a nice color, but if you don't like smells, it's a little bit strong, not too. I mean, it doesn't bother me too much. Okay, got that. And so I think I will edge Okay, 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 where's my black? I have a hard time keeping up with my stuff. I can't find anything. I'm too messy, y'all. Oh, here it is. Okay, it just needs to be cleaned really badly and organized. I've let things kind of get out of hand lately. A little 
tent. Let me see. I never did try out my buttons. I had uh, several laid out here, but now I only see two. Oh, here we go. There's a three. Um, oh, why not? That's kind of cute. Kind of unites the <clears throat> bring some more round shapes into the page hmm. all right i think that's it so there you have it folks an uh collage page And my collage book. And I kind of like it. It's really busy. Um, I probably would like to see the background be a little bit lighter. Or some of the, this paper to be like a brighter pink. But I'm just kind of learning as I go. I'm no expert at this. Just having fun. Alright, folks. Give me a thumbs up if you liked what I did here. And give me a comment. You know what I was thinking I can find some of those little half rounds I used in my ATC really fast. I know they're here somewhere. Well, I might put a few of those in there. I'm just not seeing them. They're probably buried over here on the side. Oh, you know what, though? I did have some stickers over here that I thought I might add. If I can... Oh, this thing is so crazy right now. Hmm. I don't even see those. And they should be right here. Oh, here we go. Let's see. Um, and then also there's these stickers from the Dollar Tree. God, I haven't ever seen these where I live, but when I was on vacation, I went to a Dollar Tree down there and I saw these. They're just gold stickers flowers these this one is just flowers so let me see I just want to put a few of these down here to kind of bring out the gold in this piece of paper and on the edges and I think that it will look nice There's two pieces. Let's find like a hmm. kind of like that. Adds a little bling. Now let me see if these little um they're like pieces of uh I don't know, they look like broken glass or I don't know. Something like that. Ooh. 
one. You pull the sticker right off. <clears throat> well, I got that on there. Oh my gosh. Tore the whole darn lid off. Ugh. The whole top. Oh my gosh. Well, let me see if this... These don't seem to stick as well. But I'm going to try it. This one from the Dollar Tree. Let me... I mean, it'll stick, but then, like, you come back the next day or two and it falls off sometimes. And I haven't figured out when it does and when it doesn't. So, but let me... I'm going to have to put a different cap on my Fabri-Tac. I ripped... See, look. <laughs> I ripped the top right off. It was stuck on there. Okay, where can we put this little diamond? Let's put one right there. Mm, let's put one. And if you got two, you know you need three. So let's go ahead and use a third one somewhere. Hmm. You know, I opened one of these earlier to try to use, and I hadn't used it in a while, but it had been open already. And that stuff was gummy. I couldn't even use it. I had to throw it away. It was like snot or something in there. So I guess I'm just going to have to be more careful about what I'm doing. But anyway, I think that's enough. That is really so busy. And so blingy. I feel like I need something right there. So, but let me put one more thing over here just for the heck of it. Alright. So tell me what you think. It's way too busy, huh? you know what? I love it. So, but you can still give me your opinion. <laughs> All right. Here I'm going for sure this time. Please like. Please subscribe. Join my little family and go check out my giveaway video. And go ahead and enter that. All right. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Bye now.